Well, hello everyone, Dylan here. Happy Throwback Thursday, and the rotation leads us to a Harry Potter review, and today's of which is on Aragog and the Dark Forest from 2002. <coughs> so on the front of the manual, see the, the Lego logo, older Harry Potter logo, set number 4727, and that interesting border that is like a hallway of Hogwarts, of course, and also picture of everything going on there. On the back is out of all the sets for both Sorcerer's Stone and Chamber of Secrets waves. And then after the old PCCD ROM game and one of the last building steps. So first of all, for our mini figs here, is we get both Harry and Ron Weasley, of course. But these. Or torso, torso prints, which were quite exclusive to this set, which I didn't see come in any other sets, of course. And of course, have the bar pieces for wands, of course. And if I, I were to guess why Ron's wand is in gray, is because in this movie, the wand breaks in half and he tapes it back together, of course. At least until Harry used a spell to make it one piece again. But besides that, the hair pieces and face prints, just the same as most other versions from this time. And also, no back torso print nor double side faces since they're older figures, of course. And that is it for that. First off is the great spider Aragog itself. Or himself, of course. As you see. Quite larger and more impressive than most other versions that there were, or the two other versions we had over time. Like I see, using a lot of these, like what they call uh, tail pieces from the 2001 dinosaur sets that there were, and they were often used in all kinds of things still to this day. And Kind of interesting seeing them used as legs here, but at least they fixed. But I actually think the 2018 version was is probably the most best version of it, about rifle size to it. But if compared to the figs of which, quite large, a little larger for that. Because if you look at it in the movies, then it's just a, he's a little bit smaller than them, or almost as large as them. But. Also, although, I do have this little pincher thing here from older themes used for mandibles, but although, but at least the later versions, uh, God did much better, and also the technic ball joints for eyes, and of course the back legs, which are the more longer of all, and of course his uh, uh, abdomen can turn up and down, also like the other versions, of course. And I guess that is it with Aragon. And on to one of the side builds, which is this supposed to be a tree of the Dark Forest. Oh, which quite good build to it. Like a lot of the light regular brown and dark brown and leaf pieces above and a couple of jagged slopes used for that. And also a common feature of these older sets is that if you turn this and it opens and reveals a hidden thing. And in this case, which, well, can put someone in there, but it's kind of my way of hiding this tan owl piece, of course. And next to which is which the dark, extra bit of the dark forest, of course. Although on a large base plate, which we don't see in smaller sets anymore, even though usually with like modular buildings and things. But of course, it was a common thing from older sets. It's like at least got plenty of jack and also got jacket slopes and plants representing that, and also the owl piece in gray. And of course, we get these. Uh, 
great spider web pieces, of course, to represent the large cobwebs that are going on in it. And a couple of which do have the old school spider or old spider pieces, of course. And also do have these uh, little spider tile pieces. <coughs> Bless me. But anyways, we do get a couple of the small tile pieces, which I have been seen in a couple other sets over time, and also these large uh, two by four plate tiles. Those with some spires on, it, representing the sequence in the movie when. They get surrounded by uh, swarm spiders. And of course, as the main feature of which is if you put Ron and Harry in here, and if you pull on this little thing right here, and it closes the webs on them. Kind of a neat, nice little feature. Although you don't get the Ford Angular set, which comes in to rescue them. And also, the that pull-out feature does have a hidden compartment that hides a few golden coins in it, of course. And so now, on to the final verdict on this set. Overall, this I think a pretty good set, or quite good set for the time. Like, get playing good playability with the folding in webs and some bit of out of Aragog, but at least until the later versions of Aragog kind of fixed it up a bit. And of course, also the and of course get exclusive variants of Harry and Ron, of course. But at least the even though the 2018 version of it may have done also a little bit better, but at least this one good enough. And also would have been nice if they included more uh, spider actual spider pieces also reminiscent of the spider swarm of course. And well it and so now if you still have this set from back in the day, well, I hope you had some good memories of it. And for those of you who haven't and still have access to this set, I'd say truly go ahead and get it. eBay Bricklink, whatever. And that's about it with this video. Please like, comment, subscribe. Thanks for watching.